In this video, we'll find the percent composition by mass for each element here in copper 2 chloride, CuCl2. We'll use this equation here, and the first thing we need to do is find the molar mass for the compound, for the CuCl2. When we do that, it'll look like this. So we found these values on the periodic table, and we included the subscripts here. So the molar mass for CuCl2, that's this 134.45, and the units are grams per mole. Now we can figure out each element. We'll take the molar mass of the element times the number of that element, and then divide it by the molar mass we just figured out. Let's do copper. For copper on the periodic table, it's 63.55 grams per mole. And we divide that by the molar mass for the compound we just found. We multiply by 100 to get a percent. And you'll note that grams per mole, that cancels out. We end up with 47.27%. So if we had a certain mass of this copper 2 chloride, 47.27% of that mass would be the copper in that compound. So for chlorine, we have 63.55 grams per mole. I'm not going to write the units since they'll cancel out. And the number of the element, so we're multiplying the molar mass by the number of the element, we have two chlorine atoms. Let's put those up there. And again, we divide by the molar mass of the compound, multiply by 100, and we end up with 52.73%. So if you add these numbers up here, they should add up to 100%, or very close to that. Sometimes you'll be off depending how many digits your periodic table goes out and rounds to. This is Dr. B figuring out the percent composition by mass for each element in copper 2 chloride, CuCl2. Thanks for watching.